I'm a chef and manager of Japanese Toritori restaurant and also I'm a Japanese cuisine goodwill ambassador. Today I'm going to introduce traditional Japanese dishes, chirashi sushi and kimchi ragobo. I show you how to cook and I hope you try at home. Alright, let's get started. Okay, let's cook kimchi ragobo. Burdock is a root vegetable full of dietary fiber and adds nice crunchy texture to various dishes. Kimpira gobo is a traditional Japanese dish made with burdock or gobo in Japanese. You can often find this long slender root vegetable in a supermarket in Palau. Because of the looks of its unfamiliar shape, you might think it's a bit of a challenge to cook gobo, but the truth is, it is not. Let's take a look at the ryori video and figure out how to make kimpira gobo. Said that skin is full of nutrition including fiber. However, skin sometimes has dirt on it, so you might want to tear it to get rid of the dirt. Why do you make four lines on burdock before cutting? In order to shred the burdock easier. If you cannot find one, you can add some more Japanese sake and sugar instead. Or you can find milling at the Japanese food corner at the stores.
Chirashi sushi is one of the types of sushi which is often served on Tokubetsu days, such as traditional festivals. I like the gentle and comforting taste of the mixed ingredients. Chirashi means to scatter something. As the word suggests, many kinds of colorful ingredients are scattered over the sushi rice. I like to add small pieces of carrot, burdock, and cognac. And I like to use a couple of other seasonal and local colorful ingredients. Chirashi sushi is actually easy to make. It is a popular dish to bring to your public party. And everyone will be impressed by its colors and, of course, the taste of it. Let's watch and learn how the chef makes chirashi sushi so you can make one like a pro. It's a type of seaweed. You can find them at the Japanese food corner at the store. You don't need to add any taste in the egg mixture. You do not need to add any taste in the egg mixture because other ingredients have enough taste. Yes, of course. In Japan, each area or household has different way of making chirashi sushi. So you can customize your own seafood and veggies to use.
is not to make the rice mushy. Mix the rice like a cutting motion. Why do you have to cook the rice? In order to keep the vinegar flavor in the rice. Any tips when you cut sashimi? Cut the fillet vertically to the cavernous line. Avoid touching the fish as much as possible. To make a dish look more fancy, some Japanese chefs cut vegetables and fruits decoratively and they look great on the plates. Miss Yoko Morisaki will show you how to make beautiful pieces using a knife. Why don't you try it at home to spice up your everyday meals?
this uh, sushi is so delicious. Oishi. Nato oishi ne. Mmm. This kind of nitsuke aji. Mmm. Oishi. Amakushi desu ne. Mmm. Oishi. Please try at your home. Thank you.